Hello everybody, my name is Erin. Welcome to a spinal and back bend team flow. So in this flow itself, we will be moving the spine quite a bit with some twisting movements as well as some opening, of course, to encourage more movement throughout the entire spine. So with some opening, remember to breathe as best as you can. And of course, other than opening, we'll also be focusing on strengthening our back muscles. We will not need any equipments when you're ready. Let's get started on your mats. Let's start in our happy baby pose. So lie down onto your back. Bend your knees, grab the outer edge of your feet, keeping both feet flexed up. Take a deep breath, inhale through the nose. And as you exhale, press your knees down by the sides. Let's keep your knees outside of your arm and elbows. Gently sway side to side if you like, grounding your tailbone lower back down to the floor. Relax your shoulders away from the ears. Just staying here, last three more breaths. Last two. One more breath, inhale. And exhale, release your legs. Let's take your butterfly legs lying down. So, soles of your feet together to touch. Let your knees open out to the side. Let's place your arms beside your body. Press your feet together. We're going to lift your bum up in, like, in your bridge pose. So lift your bum up and then slowly lower back down. Let's go that a few more times. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Lightly tap and then inhale up, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale to squeeze at the top, exhale lower to hover, inhale, exhale, last five, and down, up four, down, three, and down, two, and down, last one, up, can we hold it there, continue to squeeze your bum, start to work a bit on the posterior chain here, for five, four, three, two, and one, nice. Release your bum down, knees together, hug it into your chest. Just gently rock yourself up and down, up and down a couple of times. And then rock all the way up to a seated pose. Let's keep your right knee bent, drop your right knee down by the side. Let's start with a little side stretch. Left hand down, inside the left leg, right hand up, inhale. Keep the left toes flexed, exhale. Take a side bend. So you can always look down if this is more comfortable for your neck but let's keep the chest turning up reaching your right hand forward so lengthening the right side of the body Holding there for those who can maybe you can catch your left foot twist your chest up Hold for five four keep turning the chest three two and one nice release place your right hand behind now you're gonna send your bum up again so lift your bum up pushing down onto your right shin reach your left hand up and overhead stretch it out hold for five four three hips up higher two and one slowly sitting back down step your right foot down this time let's take a twist over to your right so your left hand just hugging outside of the right thigh Nice, gentle twist. Inhale, sit up tall. Exhale, twist. Look behind. Good. One last breath. Inhale. And exhale. Releasing your body. Unwind back to centre. Now reach your left hand back. Thinking of doing a wild thing. So again, push through that left hand. Grounding your right foot down. Lift the bum up. Reach your right hand up and overhead. Holding there for three, chest up higher, hips up higher. Very nice. From here, side plank. So stack your right leg on top of the left. 
and hold there in your side plank lift from the left side body pushing through your left hand last three two and one coming back the same way bend your right knee step your right foot down and then sit back down to the floor release Switch sides, extend your right leg, now straighten the left leg this time, bend the left knee down by the side. Let's take a side bend. Right hand down, inside of the right leg, left hand up, inhale, exhale, stretch. So use your breath with every exhalation, stretch your left hand forward and keep turning the chest up. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Gently release. Place your left hand down behind and then push your bum up, pressing down to your left shin, right hand over here. Breathe for three, two, and one nice sit back down step your left foot down let's twist over to your left hands hugging on to your left thigh inhale lengthen the spine a little more and then exhale look behind the left shoulder and twist last breath here inhale Exhale, coming back to center, going for that wild thing. So right hand behind, this time push up and lift your bum up. Reach your left hand up and overhead. Last three. Two. And one. Take a side plank here, stack your left leg on top of your right. Strong right hand here, strong right side body. Last five. Four, three, two, and one. Bend the left knee on top, step your left foot down, and then take a seat. Right, let's just cross your leg. Just taking a simple stretch, just the eagle arms. Place your left hand on top of your right, palms together. Inhale, open, chest up, elbows up. Exhale, crunch, elbow towards the knee. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale round, one more, inhale, exhale crunch, hold it there, let's spread the shoulder blades behind, round your back. One last breath, inhale, and then exhale, release, switch strikes now, right hand on top of your left, palms together. Inhale, elbows up, chin up. Exhale, round, crunch. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Last one. Inhale, exhale, crunch and hold. Elbows to knees. Last three. Two and one. Nice release. Both arms up. And then let's come to tabletop position. Right, just a quick one as a transition. From your tabletop, you're going to step back to plank. So try to keep your shoulders above your wrist. Keep your hips and shoulders in one line. Step one leg back, one leg back. High plank pose. Come high to the balls of your feet behind, so shifting a little forward. Press the floor away, round your back. Squeeze your inner thigh, squeeze your butt. Hold there here. Five, four, three, two, and one. Hips up, downward facing dog. If you can, try not to move your feet, your palms. Maybe just shifting your feet slightly forward if you need. Pressing your palms down, keep your fingertips spread. And then pushing through the shoulders, bring your chest back. Let's do some spinal rolls, warming up the spine. Inhale, heels up high. Chin to the chest as you exhale, roll yourself forward, vertebrae by vertebrae. Shoulders above the wrists. 
and then from here bending your knees leading from your hips arch your spine back to downward dog let's do that few more times inhale roll forward plank pose exhale bending your knees send your hips up and back down inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale come to plank pose stay there this time dropping your knees down to the floor bend your elbows chest and chin down elbows hug into the midline and tuck your toes here let's slide your body down coming to baby cobra so palms are beside your chest Keep the top of it, feet pressed down to the floor first, elbows hug in, let's hover your palms off the floor. You can keep your feet down if you like to go further, let's hover the legs off. So try to lift the thigh up from the floor and then squeeze your feet together. Let's start to work and strengthen the back muscle. So squeeze your elbows together behind, squeeze the shoulder blades. And then inhale, reach your arms forward, everything stays the same. Exhale, bend it, elbow, cactus arm squeeze. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Keep going. Inhale, exhale, squeeze. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Last three. Inhale, exhale. Last two. Inhale. Exhale, squeeze. Last one. Inhale. Exhale, squeeze. Let's hold it there. Lift the legs up higher for five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Release. Really will start to feel your back muscles here working and contracting. Coming up to a high plank, so tucking your toes under, palms beside your chest, elbows into the midline. Inhale, press up to plank and then downward facing dog, exhale. Inhale, lift your heels, bend your knees, look forward, step, hop, float to the top of your mat. Halfway lift to inhale, exhale, fold. Inhale, rising up, roll yourself up one vertebrae at a time. Inhale, palms up to touch. Exhale, bend your elbows, cactus your arms, send your heart up. Lift your chest. Elbow squeeze down beside your ribs. Inhale, back up. Exhale, squeeze, cactus. Inhale. Exhale, hips forward, chest up. One more inhale. Exhale, elbows towards your wrists. Lift your chest. Hold five, four, three, two and one inhale back up to the center all right from here we're going to take a little tricep stretch and side bend so bending your right elbow left hand catch inhale exhale take a side bend over to your left look up if you can chest up for three send your hips to the right two and one back to the center inhale Exhale, left elbow bend, left right hand catch, and then take a side bend over to your right side. And sending your hips to the left even more for three, two, and one. Nice. Back to the center. Inhale, reach both arms up. Now, from here, you can stand to the top of your mat. Okay, your feet maybe slightly. About hip width distance apart, let's grab opposite elbows. Inhale, exhale, you're going to come to chair pose, so bend your knees as you sit your bum back. We're going to try to lift from the chest and upper back, so use the back of the head to push your arms, forearms backwards. Open your elbows out to the side as best as you can. And if you can sit a little lower, right, arch the upper back instead. Hold there, five, four, Three, two, and one. Forward fold. Bow all the way down. Let's keep your elbows there. Same. Keep hugging the elbows. Relax the back of your neck. 
And then from here, right, keeping your arms like this, roll yourself up all the way to the top. Inhale. And we're going to take a gentle back bend here as you send your hips forward, chest up. Very nice. Come back to the center. One breath. Inhale. Exhale, bend your knees, sit down, chair. Holding there, five, four, three, two, and one. Forward fold, bow all the way down. Relax your neck. Inhale, roll yourself up, vertebrae by vertebrae, all the way to the standing. Take a gentle back bend here. Elbows out wide, chest up. Coming back up to the center, inhale, exhale, chair. Almost there. Stay with me, breathe. Five, four, pushing your arms back. Three, two, and one. Forward, four, exhale. Now release your hands, palms down. Pat out your feet a little here and forward, four. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, palms down, right leg steps back, drop the right knee down. Untuck your toes, let's lift yourself up to a low lunge. Good. Inhale, sit up a little taller, maybe just lifting the hips up. Exhale, sink down. So settle into the pose. Draw the right hip forward and down. We're going to add our twist here. So inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, twist to your left. Inhale. Exhale, twist. Open your arms. One more. Inhale. Exhale, twist. Open up your arms. Or from here, reach your left hand down onto your right thigh. Right hand up. Inhale. Exhale, take a gentle back bend. Maybe walking your left hand closer towards the right calf. If not, stay onto your right thigh. Reach your right hand back. Hold it there. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Very nice. Back to the center. Reach your right hand down. Left hand up to twist. Okay, so I'm just going to switch sides. Place the left hand behind your head. Left elbow up. Inhale. Exhale. Left elbow to right elbow. Inhale. Open. Exhale. Close. Inhale. Exhale. Two more, inhale, exhale, one more, inhale, and exhale, very nice, inhale, open, from here, release, straighten your left hand up, and you're going to send your left leg all the way back to a modified side plank, so just sweep the left leg all the way back, if you need a little balance, let's tuck your back toes under, okay, so keep the left leg floated up, from here, let's bend the left knee, keep the left foot flexed, Okay, and try to kick the left leg back away from your body. Good. Hold that. Five, four, flex the foot and kick the left leg back away from your spine, away from your glutes. And then slowly, right hand catch the left foot and now you're going to kick it. So this is more passive. Kick the foot into your hands, stretch and open your chest out to the front. Four, five, four, three, Two and one. Release the leg, drop your left foot behind, almost to like a mini wild thing. So place the left hand behind your head, open your chest up to the sky. Last three. Bring your left elbow towards the side. Two and one. Nice. Release the left hand, set your left palm down, set your Left knee down, let's bend the elbow, drop your chest and chin down to the floor. So you stay here. For those who can, maybe you like to interlock your arms behind. So whatever option you take, stay there for last five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Nice. Release. Palms down. Untuck your toes. Glide forward. Let's come to your baby cobra one more time. Let's bring your palms. Hover your palms off the floor. Squeeze your elbows and shoulder blades behind. And then inhale. Reach your arms forward. Exhale. Squeeze. Inhale. 
exhale four inhale exhale three inhale exhale two last one inhale exhale one and then try to hover your legs off squeeze your inner thighs together hold for five four three two and one very nice release melt yourself down palm beside your chest tuck your toes under push yourself press up to plank downward facing dog exhale one breath inhale exhale side up lift your heels bend your knees look forward step or hop to the top halfway lift to inhale exhale four inhale rising up all the way up to standing palms to touch at the top this time let's grab your opposite elbows from the other side inhale exhale chair pose bend your knees sit your bum back again use the back of the head try to push the forearms back open up your chest and your upper back here elbows to the side hold for the last three two and one forward fold straighten your legs bow down and then inhale slowly roll up to standing keep your arms like this and then take a gentle back bend send your hips forward chest up elbows back for three two and one back to the center inhale exhale chest sit down sit your bum back chest up hold five four three keep breathing two and one forward fold straighten your legs bow all the way down and then gently roll yourself up to standing inhale Take a gentle back bend here. Send your hips forward, chest up. Back to the center. Exhale, chair pose. Bend your knees. Hold it there for five. Breathe. Four. Three. You got this. Two. And one. Nice forward. Four. Straighten your legs, bow all the way down. And then you can relax your hands. Just pedal your feet out slightly. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, palms down. This time, step your left foot back, left knee down. Let's come to low lunge. Inhale, rising up. Take a breath, inhale, as you send your hips up slightly. Then exhale, sit lower, settling into your low lunge. Inhale. Exhale, twist over to your right. Open your arms front and back. Two more times, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Very nice. And then reach your right hand down towards your left thigh. Left hand up and over here. Taking a gentle back bend. If you can, crawling your right fingertips towards your ankle. Hold. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Back to the center. Reach your left hand down. Right hand up. Place your right hand behind your head, inhale, exhale, right elbow to left, touch, inhale to open, exhale, inhale, exhale, last two, inhale, exhale, one more, inhale, exhale, open up, inhale, straighten up your right hand, now you're going to send your right leg all the way to the back. So you can keep your left toes tucked under to find your balance first. And then one motion if you can sweep the right leg all the way back. Just adjust your stance quickly if you need. Okay, and then from here, bend your right knee at the top. Keep your right foot flexed and try to kick the right leg away from your body. So you start to send your chest forward. Kick your right leg away. So a little active movement here, active stretch. Five. Four. Three two and then one now you can catch your right foot and then see if you can kick the foot into your hands open up the chest even more now for five for four three chest forward two and one release your leg right foot just step down land it down left hand behind your head almost like a baby half moon so turn the chest up to the sky bring your right elbow down towards the other side and then breathe for three, 
two and one release right palm down right knee down to the floor inhale exhale chest and chin down to the floor again keep it here you can interlock your arms behind stay here for those who can maybe like see if you can lift the knees off the floor and then bring your knuckles up higher right wherever you are stay there hold for five four three two and one slowly release your knees down release your hands palms down untuck your toes glide forward into your cobra pose relax your shoulders push it away from the ears maybe rocking side to side and then coming to upward facing dog so press the tops of your feet down can we float your both thighs off and then from here press the top of the left foot down even more float the right leg off hold five four three two and one release and switch left leg floats up five four three two and one release good work downward facing dog send your hips up and back stretch it up inhale exhale one more inhale exhale good inhale let's sweep your right leg up to the sky bend the knee open up your hips scorpion tail inhale lift your left heel off the floor and then we slowly with control drop the left knee down to the floor still keeping your right leg open in the scorpion tail good and then left lift your left knee off scorpion tail inhale exhale dropping the left knee down with control tabletop inhale up and then exhale down one more time inhale push up scorpion tail and then exhale draw your right knee towards the chest step forward in between your hands drop your left knee down let's come to your low lunge in your rise up exhale twist open to your right side taking your back bend right hand down left hand up reach your left hand back see if you can sit lower this time reach back even more for three two and one as you bring your left hand down to cut wheel you're going to straighten your right leg coming to a half split twist here keep pulling the right hip back send the right hip back left hip forward right hand up from here we're going to swing that right leg back to a modified side plank so in one motion swing the right leg all the way back and then bend your right knee at the top right hand catch and kick the foot into your hands hold it there five four three two and one bring your right heel to the bum you're going to pivot back to the center as you straighten your right leg set your right palm down reach your left hand forward let's go control here from here bend your left elbow cactus bend your right knee you can point your toes in here open everything exhale crunch left elbow to right knee inhale open exhale crunch inhale exhale inhale exhale last one inhale open and then left hand go to the back catch tiger pose kick your right foot up and away opening up the left shoulder try your best look up if you can for five four three two and one nice bring your right heel to the bum all right we're going to try this time see if you can lift the left knee off like this so if not you can just do what we did earlier back to a scorpion tail so i'm going to try here myself it's quite challenging you're going to tuck your back toes 
try to lift the back leg off. See, I'm struggling a bit. And then try to keep the grip coming to your almost like a variation of your scorpion tail. And then kick the right foot away from your left hand. And we're going to see, we're going to try to come back down. So bring your right heel to your bum and then slowly set the left knee down. <laughs> it's my worst side actually. All right, kick the right leg one more time into your hands. Good, wherever you are, release now back to scorpion tail, left palm down. And we lift the left foot up, bend the right knee, scorpion tail. From here, we're going to drop to our wild thing, slowly stepping your right foot behind and lift the hips up. Place your right hand behind your head, open up your chest to a wild thing. And breathe, last three, two, and one. All right. Quick transitions to your side plank here as you stack your right foot on top of your left, pressing into the left palm. And then draw your right knee into your chest. Pivot onto your left toes as you step forward as smoothly as you can. High crescent lunge. Great work. Inhale, reach both arms up to the sky. Taking your back bend here as you exhale. Sit your hips down. Reach your arms back, chest up. And breathe here for five, four, three, two, and one very nice back to the center reach your arms along your body aeroplane arms you're going to float to your warrior three so start to lean forward pick your back leg off we're going to do imagine your cow spine in your warrior three so you're going to arch the upper back so lift the chest up keep your hips square keep lifting the chest up hold it there for five four three two and one very nice you're going to come up to standing prepare for your revolve dancer so bend your left knee at the back right hand to catch the outside of your left leg reach your left hand up inhale exhale kick the leg into your hands try your best it's okay if you lose your balance just go back in nice and then we're going to switch sides so you're going to release and catch, use the left hand to catch the inside of the left ankle, right hand up and exhale this time, go for your dancer pose, again kick your left leg up, kick it away from you, reach your right hand forward, last three, two, and one, all right, coming to your sugar cane pose from here, so switch your grip, grab from the outside, you can bend your right knee slightly as you reach your fingertips down and kick your leg away from you again into your hands. Opening up for your sugar cane pose. Breathe here, last three. Stay with me, I know. Two. And then release for your half moon pose as you kick your left leg back, left hand up. Coming to a wild thing here one more time. So the transition here, bending your right knee, set your left hand down, left foot down. You're gonna flip your right foot all the way back. Step it down, lift your hips up. Good, this time for those who are warmed up, you can even go for your full wheel pose, okay? If not, just stay in your wild thing. Hold it there, last three. Keep breathing, two. And one, slowly flip yourself all the way back to a plank pose. Nice work there, I know lots of back bends here, inhale. Exhale, drop your knees down, chest and chin down to the floor. Alright, another variation here, you're going to kick your right leg up to the sky, bend your right knee on top, toes to the hip. You can stay here or see if you can catch your right foot with your both hands. And continue to kick the right leg up. Hold it there for five, four, three, two, and one. Heel to the bum, release your hands. Back to knees, chest, chin, and inhale, glide forward up to your up dog or cobra. Exhale, back to downward facing dog. 
great work. Right? Lots of back bend, all right? Lots of spine here. Let's take one deep breath, inhale. Exhale, side up. Inhale now, let's move to the left side, left leg up, three leg dog bend the knee, open up your hips, scorpion tip. Right, lift your right heel off slowly, you're going to drop the right knee down to the floor, keeping your scorpion tail leg on the left side. And then lift your right knee up back to scorpion tail, inhale. Exhale, with control, dropping the right knee down to the floor. Inhale, press back up. Exhale, right knee down. Nice. Just last one. Inhale, up. Exhale, left knee to the chest. Step forward in between your hands. Low lunge. Drop your right knee down. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, twist. Open to your left side. Arms front and back. And then go for your back bend. Left hand, reach back. Right hand up and over here. Hold it there. Three, two, and one. Back to the center. As you wheel your right hand down, start to straighten the left leg, coming to a half split in your twist. Great work. Hold it there. Sending the left hip back. Tuck your toes, back toes, your right toes under. You're going to swing the left leg all the way back to your modified side plank pose and then bend the left knee at the top, left hand catch. Kick the left foot away from you, chest open to the front for five, four, three, two, and one. Bring your left heel to the bum, okay, and then slowly we're going to re-extend back the left leg. Step your left palm down, pivot to the center and reach your right hand forward. And then can we cactus your right elbow, bend the left knee at the back. Inhale, open. Exhale, crunch. Right elbow to left. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. One last. Inhale, hold it there. Squeeze. And then right hand, go to the back catch your left foot, kick the left leg into your hands, so a tiger pose. Look up if you can, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, just bring the left heel to the bum. Same idea like earlier, if not, just go back up to your scorpion tail. If you can, keep your grip there. You're going to tuck your back toes under, push and lift up in your downward dog position and continue to kick that left leg into the hand it's very challenging here try your best no worries you can always lose the grip right coming back the same way so you're going to bring the heel to the bum if it's easier start to lift the right heel and then slowly with control set the right knee back down back to your tiger pose one more time kick the left leg up for three for two and one very nice this time release your hands wherever you are let's meet back in your scorpion tail dropping to your wall thing so control your step your left foot behind left hand behind your head as you lift your hips up elbow out to the side breathe five four three two and one side plank here Stacking your left leg on top of the right just for a quick one. And then bend the top knee, left knee to the chest. Pivot onto your right toes as you step forward. High crescent lunge. Reaching both arms up. And we're going to take a back bend as you exhale. Sing your hips down and forward. Chest up, lean back. So opening up from the upper back here. No compression on the lower back. Stay there. Breathe. Last three. Two. And one. Very nice. Come back to center. Swing your arms back. Aeroplane wings as you lean forward. You're going to pick your back leg off. Warrior three. And then thinking of cow spine here. Keeping your hips square as you arch your upper back a little more. Send your chest up. 
look up, lift. Hold it there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Come to standing as you bend your bottom right knee. Left hand, catch your right foot from the inside. Let's go for a revolve dancer first. Arms up and exhale. Try to kick right foot away. Hold it there. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, switch sides now. If you can, try to keep your right leg off the floor. Find your balance. Right leg, catch your right foot. Right ankle from the inside. Go for your dancer pose. Kick the right leg up, up, up. Lean forward. Last three. You got this. Last two. It's okay if you lose balance. And one. One more. Let's drop your left fingertips down for your Shopasana here. Switch your grip if you need. Bend your left leg a bit. Touch your left fingertips down. And then kick the right leg up. Open the right knee up to the sky. Good work there, stay with me. You got this, find your balance and a half moon pose. Release your right leg. Straighten your both right leg and right arm. Wild thing, so you're gonna bend your left knee, set your right hand down, right toe, step down. You're gonna flip back, step your left foot behind, flip yourself all the way back. And if you're ready, go for your full wheel pose. Breathing here for five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Wherever you are, take your time, flip yourself back to a high plank pose. Reset in here. Exhale, knees down, chest and chin down to the floor. You know what's coming. Right, left leg up to the sky this time. You can always keep your palms beside your chest, just bending your left knee on top, toe to the head. Right, if you can go further, see if you can grab your left leg and then kick it up. Five, four, three, kick up higher, two, and one. Heel to the bum, release, back to your knees, chest, chin, and then inhale, glide forward, push yourself up to a cobra pose exhale deck to downward facing dog right knees down take a quick child's pose sit your bum back to the heel rest your forehead down to the floor We're gonna slowly roll yourself up, lie down onto your backs. We're gonna do a, just a slight counter with a bit of core work here. So let's come to your recline crow. So you're gonna flex your palms up. You're gonna draw your knees towards your armpit. Okay, you're gonna crunch up like that. So as you crunch, you're gonna lift your hips up. Let's go for 30 times. So palms up, ready, knees up. 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, hit up if you like. 3, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, last 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, last one we hold for 10, 9, 8, hips up, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Release. Set your feet down, keep with distance apart. Let's come to bridge pose. Lift your bum up. If you think you have enough back bends for today, just stay here. You can stay here and rest and chill. If you can go further and your back's already warm up, let's come to wheel pose. Kick your left leg up. To the sky in bridge you can do so as well hold it there for five four three two and one switch sides left foot down right leg up hold for five four three two 
and one all right for those in bridge just continue to stay there if those in wheel let's reach your right hand up place your right hand onto your right thigh push for five four strong left hand three two and one right hand down switch left hand to left thigh five four three two and one nice release everyone roll yourself down lie down onto your back hug your knees in rock your spine side to side let's rock your up yourself up and down a few times and then rock all the way up to seated pose sit cross-legged let's take a twist in here exhale twist over to your right inhales to center exhale to the left good inhale back to the center exhale interlock your arms palms up one more inhale exhale push your arms forward as you round your spine spread your shoulder blades chest back put your chest back towards your spine chin to the chest inhale back up exhale release i thank you everyone for joining me today in this spine and back bend flow so hope you enjoyed this flow do check out my other theme flows as well if you liked i'll see you soon again on the mat namaste